Emilio Bonifacio and his 22-game hitting streak. Well, the Marlins facing the Mets, and Bonifacio would get number 23 out of the way pretty quickly, facing Mets starter Dylan G in the bottom of the first. Bonifacio, a single to right, make that 23 games. He would later score on a Hanley Ramirez ground out to tie it at one. Bottom two, here's Mike Stanton. Stanton liner, left field, get out of here! The Blue Cedar in a hurry. Stanton, number 22 for him, two to one Florida. Still in the second, Bonifacio, another hit. This one into center field. And now the Marlins have a 3-1 lead over the Mets. Top five, still 3-1. Anibal Sanchez, who got the start for the Marlins. In a bit of trouble, two on, a 2-0 count to Carlos Beltran. Job well done by Sanchez. Gets Beltran to ground out to second. Top six after a Jason Bay RBI. It's 3-2. Josh Tolley swinging, and then Lucas due to the same. Eight Ks on the afternoon for Sanchez. Top seven, David Wright standing in. Looking for the lead, and he gets it. It's a two-run shot for Wright. His first home run since May. Of course, he's been on the DL for a while. 4-3 New York. Bottom eight, Bobby Parnell in. Logan Morrison out. The solo shot to deep central, number 15 for Lomo. Ties the game at four. We're still in the eighth. Two outs. John Buck, the pinch hitter at the dish. Breaking ball wide into right center field. That's a base hit. And now the Marlins have a 5-4 lead. They turn it over to the closer, Leo Nunez, and Nunez gets the job done. Swing and a miss, Justin Turner. Ball game, 5-4 the final. Randy Choate, the win and relief. Anibal, seven innings, four earned to go along with those eight Ks. Bonifacio, Morrison, Stanton, two hits apiece for Nunez's 28th save.